everybody. Welcome to my cozy cottage. How are you all doing? Thank you so much for stopping by. Jody and Tootsie here. Oh, she's smiling at you. <laughs> Jody and Tootsie here for our Timu haul today. Happy Sunday. I usually like to start off my videos with giving my little Tootsie a kiss. She's my rescue pup and I got her about six or seven months ago. I also have a Chihuahua journey for, I've had him for about 13 years. But he likes to stay in his little doggy bed. He's a little more camera shy. But Tootsie, yeah, I bring her in. But sometimes her personality, you never know. What do you think, Tootsie? You want a little kiss? <laughs> it's funny to see what she's gonna do. I never know. Ready? Oh, she's like, you snuck in a kiss. Okay, all right, Tootsie, let's begin with our team of all. all right, she's gonna be my little assistant. So I like to try to find lots of bargains and I like to share them with you. This top I'm wearing was something I purchased from Timu, but this was last year, but I'll show you how it fits. And if you type in different things on Timu, you could type in V-neck short sleeve tops. I think that's what I did to find this. Little colorful, but I felt like bringing out some bright colors for spring. So I'll show you how this fits. And I have a couple other t-shirts I'm gonna show you. And I do do try on so you can see how they run and how they fit. All right, so let's see what we have here first. I'm going to start out with this bargain of the day. I couldn't believe it. So what I do is I type in different things in the feed or I'll type in when I'm searching like purses or something. I type in low to high and I just see what's there and I'm not really looking for anything in particular. Sorry for the crinkle. Give me a second to open. All right. So this is adorable for spring. It is a nylon purse, and these are the kind that I love. They have lots of zippers. It comes with a webbing strap that is adjustable, which I also love. I have a plain black one like this, okay? Let me show you a close-up of the print. Is that not adorable for spring? And I'm gonna tell you, it has a front zipper, working zipper, which I love to put like my debit card and my license, oops, let me hold it higher, in the front. Then it has another working one, and this one here, like I'll organize where I want my lipstick and things that I want to get at quick in the second one. And then inside it has a zippered top, and let's see what's inside. I'm trying to see, I have to look down to see if there's any other pockets inside. No, I don't see any of the pockets inside, but let me tell you, there's a good amount of room in there. Really cute for summer, and there's a print on the back. All right, so the best part of this, and yes, I will use these. This is a good size. It's perfect for me. I got this for $1.13. Let me double check, but yep, $1.13. How cute is that? So yeah, I bought two. I'm, I'm going to put one away for a gift. You know, that time of year something comes up, I'm putting one away. But I think this is, this was my deal of the day, definitely. Isn't it cute? Let me know in the comments. Also, what I wanted to say about these is because they're nylon, they don't get wet, and because it has the webbing handle, they're strong enough to carry heavier things. Sometimes your handles wear off. I actually like this type of handle. I put like water bottles in mine, or sometimes a can of soda when I'm bringing it to work. So these are great. All right, next, going along with the bag theme, found another deal. This one is a one shoulder backpack. Look how cute, right? It has butterflies and flowers, and it has a little zipper in the front to store things. And then it has a zipper here in the middle definitely could fit your phone or whatever lots of things and then does it have another let me look no I guess that's it that's the main zipper it's funny though it doesn't look like that's the main pocket let me just double check yeah I guess that is I'm gonna open it up and see hmm yeah okay and it has the webbing strap cute print and yeah that's a cute bag really cute 
Let me zip it back up and I'll check the price. Cute. All right, let's see. What did I pay for that one? Got my little clipboard here. Butterfly backpack, are you ready for this? $1.27. So that's just a little higher than the deal of my $1.13 hot air. I really like that one, but this is also cute and it's a good size. I mean, here's my hand. Cute, right? That's what I love about Timu. You get to shop like a billionaire even though you're not. All right, let's see what's next. Okay, this is something, I have a pool. And if you have a pond or something, I think this is neat. Can you guess what this is? This is a duck decoy. And I wanna float it in my pool. I think it would be so cute to have a little duck floating around in the pool. It's plastic. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. How cute is that? So it floats in your pool. I don't know why it has, I think this is really used for hunting because it has a little hole here for you to pull it, I guess, if you put it in the, when you're hunting. But I'm putting it just to float around my pool. I think it is so cute. Let me know in the comments what you think. Isn't he adorable? <laughs> yeah, look at the detail on the painting, right? Cute. All right. Now for the time, what's the cost? Let's see. Duck decoy, $4.54. So I can't wait to put that in my pool, $4.54. Although I'm not hunting, I hope it doesn't cause something to come to my pool. <laughs> All right, let's see what's next. Let's look at the t-shirts. I took them out of the bag so you don't hear the crinkle. So this first t-shirt is dog print with hearts is that not adorable little paw prints and little hearts and i just love my my little doggies they're just my family too <laughs> so i got one for me and one for my sister so we'll be twins remember when you're little and your parents dress you up like twins and you never liked it well i bought my sister matching matching shirts so i got one in two sizes for each of us so i have two and I'm gonna check what they're made of, and these feel so nice. They're not shiny. I believe these actually have cotton in them. Usually most things from Timu are polyester, and I actually had someone ask me if they ever had anything with cotton, and this is the first time I found some t-shirts that have it. So these have 65% cotton and 35% polyester. So that's great, because usually a lot of things are mostly polyester here. So these will be real comfortable to wear in the summer. So I will try on one for you. At the end of the video, I try on and do a little mini fashion show to show you how they look. So those are a great deal, and I got two of those. Let's see what I got. I'm saying great deal, I didn't tell you the price yet. <laughs> but I'm sure when it's Timu, it's always a great deal. All right, dog shirt, $2.57. $2.57. Unbelievable. <laughs> All right, next up, I'll show you the other shirt that I found. This is, it says, be still and know. Psalm 46, 10. Look how pretty. Look at the print. It has butterflies and pink and flowers. So pretty. And I believe this one is the same thing. It's very soft. It's not shiny. It feels like it has cotton. Let me look. Yes, same thing. 65% cotton and 35% polyester. So that's, that's great. Really great. Very comfy, cool for the summer. Very nice. And this is definitely something I would wear to church. All right, let's see what's next. I have to show you this. In my bathroom, and I'm gonna include a clip, I bought these little bunny towels. They're little mini towels shaped like a bunny. They're pink, I use pink in my bathroom. 
And I purchased two and I put them on a little tray in my bathroom and they look so cute. I love those little towels because they remind me of when you go on a cruise and they make little animals. Well, I bought one for my daughter. And this is the white, she likes white. It's a teddy bear towel. And they look so cute in your bathroom with like some little soaps on a little tray. And I bought her the white teddy bear towel for her bathroom. Isn't that adorable? I think they're so cute. I probably should have got her two. I usually like to put two. I'll probably get one more of these because it's so adorable and put two on a tray in your bathroom. So the teddy bear, you're not gonna believe this price. I, I was just like, I'm just so shocked when I find these little cute things on there at these great prices. I believe it's 69 cents. Give me a second to look for it. Yep, bear towel, 69 cents. Where can you go when you buy things for 69 cents nowadays, right? So, bear towel. All right. It's really cute. Next up, I bought this. Now, what this is, is a reusable bag. And it's made out of nylon. And I wanted it to keep in my purse. Because I can't tell you how many times I go to the store. And you need... Wow, it folds up real small. Let me show you. It folds up like a wallet. You need a bag when you go shopping because I don't like the paper bags, especially when I go to Dollar Tree now and stuff. They rip on me and it's just a pain. So this is one that I can keep in my purse and bring into the stores if I can figure out how to open it. Let's see, how do I open it? I wonder if you pull this string. No. Nope. Hmm. Flip it inside out, maybe? Give me a second, I'll figure it out. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so I figured it out. You flip it inside out and you push it and it folds this nice and tiny. And then you flip it again and it all opens up. Got it. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look at this. I need, I need to take a thumbnail with this one. I love dogs, but I can't believe the size of this. It's not even open all the way. Here we go. Look at this. Full size of the camera. How cute. So this is the little pocket that it folds into. When you're done with it, that's how you fold it. Oh, I'll be honest. I don't know if I'll be able to get it back into that, but I'll try. So it has two handles and it is really large and I love the dogs. The only thing I'm gonna show you is the only flaw, the back. My dogs are upside down. <laughs> but you know what? It doesn't matter to me. I bought this to go shopping. Look how cute, right? Um, it's just plain inside. It's just a big nylon bag, shopping bag, reusable. Perfect, and like I said, good size, really good size. So what did I pay for it? How cute is that? I am so happy with this. You, you just don't always know when you order too, you know? Very cute. All right, what did I pay for the doggy reusable bag? Hmm, dog bag, the tote bag was $1.77. And on Timo you get price adjustments. So I actually even got that, so they took off 40 cents. So I paid like $1.37 for this in the, in the end. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Let's hope I can fold it back up. <laughs> All right. Also, I want to show you, if, if there's any links that you want, if you, if there's any links that you really request, I ask that you leave me a comment. Um, I try to put up some of the links, but in order to put up the video quicker, it takes me a while to put up the links. So if there's something you really want, leave me a comment and I'll get the link quickly into the description box for you. Okay. Now next up, this is for my little granddaughter. Let's take it out of the plastic. It is a little unicorn lunchbox. Look how cute. Really cute. Has a zipper top. Let's unzipper it. If I can find the zipper, here it is. Oh my gosh, and it's insulated. Wow, wasn't expecting that. Look insulated and fully open let me show you it's big look from the side how cute is that 
lot of times we go to the beach and she likes to take her own little bag, not even for, for lunch or school. That is really cute. And it has this nice nylon feel to it. So what did I pay for the lunch bag? Ready? A dollar and 17 cents. I love it. <laughs> All right. Even when I buy it later, when I see it, I'm like, oh my gosh, I got such a great deal on that. Next up, I of course, I bought something for little Mia, so I picked up something for my grandson. So these are, if I can open it, these are dinosaur cars. Each one is different, and he loves dinosaurs. We have the blue, and they have a good size little wheel. I mean, it's plastic, but cute. Yellow, pink, green. Cute, so cute. And I'm just gonna dump them out, so I don't have to pull them all out. And I'll just let you know how many. So I got a bag of them. Let's see. So some of them are repeats, just so you know. Well, not really. The blue, there's three blue, three pink, two yellow, one green. Cute. So let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten dinosaur cars. And you can see the size. Cute. This one's a triceratops. All right, let's see. What did I pay for those dinosaur cars? $2.54. $2.54. So I thought that was a great deal for him. Next up, I have a box. I already cut it open to see what this is. This is, I just, when I find deals, I buy them. And this is sunglasses. Now, when you go to the Dollar Tree now, I believe their sunglasses are up to $1.50. These sunglasses were, I believe, $0.62. Cents. So you're actually better off if you can wait to order from Timu and you can find some for $0.62. Cents. Look at the side. Little gold. Yeah, they're plastic. Are they the greatest quality? No, but I keep them everywhere. One in my car, different places. I may keep a couple in my car, and it's just nice to have. So what I like about these two is they're actually lighter on the bottom and darker on the top. So let's see how they fit. Yeah. So for 62 cents, yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, great, great deal. I love the gold on the side, really cute. So sunglasses for 62 cents. Love it, love, 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 love. <laughs> All right, next up. I got this for my sister too. She loves the Golden Girls. Sorry for the crinkle, let's see. Oh good, I cut the end already. Look how cute this is, stay golden. Oh my God, are they not adorable? So I got that for her. She loves the Golden Girls, cute. They made them look like little dolls, adorable. What did I pay for that? Golden Girls, little makeup bag, hmm. I see it. A dollar thirty-nine. Dollar thirty-nine. Now, let's open it up. I think it's more like a pencil case type of thing, you know. Hi, Tootsie. You coming back? Come here. Come on. She's coming back. My assistant. She takes a lot of breaks. You coming back? What do you think of the Golden Girls? Do you want to say cheese for the camera? Cheese. <laughs> She's like, what is she doing? My little assistant. Oh, well, you got all dirty outside. All right, so $1.39. I was gonna, sorry, look inside. Yeah, it's just like a fabric. So more like a pencil box. I would not use it for makeup. Sometimes I like to keep some of my pill bottles in these. I like to use them for that. So that's for my sister. She loves the Golden Girls. All right, next up, another bargain I found. This is a hair cutting set. It comes with the comb, the scissors, and I don't even know what else. Let's open it up and see. I got this, not for me. My sister is a hairdresser, thank God she does my hair. But I got this because I trim my dogs. And 
it actually works pretty good for them. So let's see what came in this. I'm going to dump it out. So it came with the thinning scissors. Now they are plastic, but pretty good. Regular scissors to trim because I trim their fur. And then look at this. Two kinds of combs. I think I'll have to ask my sister, but I think this does something and thins out the fur. I'll have to ask her. I don't know. But anyways, I got these four pieces to trim. And like I said, I'm using them for my dogs for 94 cents. Can you believe it? 94 cents. How cute is that, right? So these are for my dogs. I have to be their hairdresser <laughs> sometimes in between grooming. And I am going to ask her about this. I think this thins out the hair, uh, the fur, or hair. Look, well, in my case, it'll be fur. So I believe that is it from this Timu haul. I will do a quick try on fashion show for you now. Try on the couple tops so you can see how they fit. I'll show you the one I'm wearing. Also, this pendant came from Timu. Well, actually, this was a necklace that the chain broke. And I just put the, I kept the pendant. I didn't return it. And I put it on my own silver chain. All right, so I'll do a quick try on and I'll be back. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing today. I ordered this last year. I typed in V-neck woman t-shirt or tops and that's how I found this one. And I love the colors, I love the fit. It's really nice and this one was a size extra large. Okay, now on to the paw print t-shirt with the little hearts. I think the shoulder, the length is nice on the arms. The fit is really nice. I love that it's 65% cotton. It feels nice and comfy, cozy, cute. Yeah, this gets a Jody thumbs up, that's for sure. Okay, this is the last top. And yes, this one fits nice. Arm length is good. I love that it's, like I said, 65% cotton. It's breathable. It has a lot of stretch and room. The fit is really nice. And this was an, is a size XL. So yeah, gets a Jody thumbs up. All right. So what did you think of the quick mini fashion show? At least you get an idea of how things fit. That's why I do it. Because you never know whether to size up or size down when you're ordering online. Most of those are pretty true to size, in my opinion. So I'd like to thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you stopping by and visiting Tootsie and I at my cozy cottage. I also like to do a lot of decorating and I'd love for you to consider subscribing and joining my cozy cottage family. And a thumbs up is so greatly appreciated. It helps YouTube know that someone's watching our videos. So it really helps if you do a thumbs up. Tootsie say thumbs up. <laughs> there you go, Tootsie says it too. All right. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye for now, my friends. Say bye, Tootsie. <laughs> That's her bye. Tootsie, say hello. Hi, baby. Welcome to my cozy cottage. Jody and Tootsie here. And we are doing a combo video today. We're sharing a few things from Timu. So it's a mini Timu haul. And we are showing a tablescape. And the items I'm showing will be related to the tablescape. Today I'm joining in a collaboration called Tablescape Tuesdays. And our host is the Grace Life DIY, and that's Anna, and Amethyst Adventures, and that's Courtney. And this is an open collaboration every week where you share a tablescape. Now in my video, I'm going to share a few things that I use for the tablescape and then I'll already show the tablescape finished. I won't be 
presenting and having you see how I set up the table to save some time. So let's start with a little bit of this Timo haul. First of all, I want to share these earrings and I'll show you a clip on what I'm wearing before we begin. It's all from Timo. So these earrings are sterling silver from Timo. This top is from Timo. And I tried instead of jewelry today, this is a neck, it's like a neck scarf with pearls in it. And this also came from Timu. These were 89 cents. And I thought it would be something different to wear with the top. All right, so let's begin with the haul and we can move on to the tablescape. So this is my inspiration for my tablescape this week. This is a flamingo. You put that in the bag and it lights up and this is going to be the centerpiece for my table. Are you guessing the theme for my tablescape? I will put some batteries in it and you'll see it lit up on the table because it does have batteries on the back. And the size, here's my hand, so I would say it's about nine inches maybe, nine inches tall. Cute, 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 cute. Next, I want to share my, these are my placemats. Now, I haven't recently purchased these. I got these last year from Timo, but I wanted to show the nice quality of these. They're like silk leaf placemat, and they'll be on my tablescape. And these I got last year for about $3 and change. I did look this year to see if I could find them to link them below. I couldn't find any like these, but I did find they also have big leaf placemats that you can order from Timu that were a really good price. Now for my centerpiece, I'm also going to be using some pink flowers. I recently hauled these from Timu and I will be adding these in. I thought they had a tropical look, so these were also from Timu and I got a bunch of nine picks for about five dollars and change. So those will be in there. And next up, Timu has napkin rings. I got a great price on these napkin rings. They were six napkin rings for $1.59. To get that many, that's a, a great deal to get that many napkin rings. So let's look at them. Oh yeah, pretty. Just a simple gold and it'll go with pretty much anything. Cute. So six for a dollar fifty-nine. So those will be on my table. Now I'm gonna share these. This it is really heavy. This is going to be the flatware for the table. And boy is it heavy. I got a set of 20 gold flatware for six dollars and 39 cents. Now prices change on Timo. They may not be that price right now. It's something you have to always look, but let's take a look and see how they are. Oh, yeah, very nice. Here's a butter knife. Let's take out a spoon just to get an idea. It's just a simple plain gold. And for six dollars and change to get a set of 20. Let's look at the forks. Here's the fork. Really nice. Yep, so I have the whole setup here. And let me tell you, it is really heavy. So I'll have to take the time to undo and open up each one of these for my tablescape. Actually, I'm going to do a table for two, so I won't be using all of them. But, oh, I highly recommend. These are really nice for the money. I did look for um, other sets, and like I could find sets for 20 pieces for like $10, $11. It's very common on there to find them. All right, next up, I want to share. This isn't really relevant to my tablescape, but it is relevant to Tropical. They had slip flip flops, which are summerish, so that's why I'm calling them since I had them and they came in with the order. <laughs> Look at these flip-flops, aren't they cute? With the heel like that, a wide top, and oops, flew out of my hands. 
Uh, let me see if the top has stretch. Oh yeah, and the top has stretch. So cute. Very cute. And these were $2.69. So for that price, right? Free. All right, and the last thing I want to share before I start showing my tablescape is my plates. Look at these plates. Now, unfortunately, these were not Timu. These I got last year, and I never got to use them, from the Christmas tree shop. And I'm so sad that's closed. That was a store that I used to love to go to, and they are closed. So there's no more Christmas tree shop, but I'm glad I got my little flamingo plates. So I am going to put all this together and get the tablescape ready, and I'll share that with you. And my little Tootsie, she's snoozing today. So no kisses from my Tootsie today, but maybe at the end. All right, so with all that being said, let's go over to the tablescape. Here we go. Before we go over to the table, let's check out the outfit of the day. So here I'm trying to show you a close-up of these sterling silver earrings. They are gorgeous. I love the way they look. And here is a close-up of the neck scarf that I ordered, 89 cents. I think it's cute. But I'll also give you a look of how the top looks without the scarf too. So this top is actually one of my favorites. I love the colors. I love the sleeve length. It fits nice. And it's just that floral print, tropical, kind of going along with the uh, tablescape. So I picked this one. I did purchase this last year. And here's the look without the scarf. So either way, I think the top looks cute. Okay, welcome to my tropical flamingo tablescape. Let's take a closer look. I am so happy with that little flamingo. It is adorable. And what I did was I placed it inside a little floral pot and I added my pink and I added some white flowers. And I think that makes an adorable centerpiece. And I just really did simple white candles and the flamingo plate. Here's a close up. And here's the silverware that I got from Timu. It shines so much. It's so pretty. And I love it next to that napkin ring. So it's a very simple, but I think it makes an adorable impact. And let me show you a close-up of my glasses. I went with a green glass to tie in with the green placemat. And I did want to show that even my coaster, which is a pale pink, these were also from Timu. I think I got a set of four or six of those for a dollar and change. Those are like a faux vinyl leather coaster. So you really can find a lot of nice things for your tablescapes from Timu and at a good price. And it still has a really cute look. So let me know what you think. I'd love to hear your thoughts and what was your favorite part. And I'd like to thank you so much for watching. I'd like to thank Anna and Courtney for hosting Tablescape Tuesdays. And I hope you have a wonderful night, my friends. I'd love for you to consider subscribing, joining my Cozy Cottage family, and a thumbs up is greatly appreciated. It really helps our channels and lets YouTube know someone is watching our videos. Thanks again for watching, my friends. Bye for now. Let's see. Say hello. Hi, baby. Hi everybody, welcome to my cozy cottage. Thank you so much for stopping by. Happy Thursday to you. Today I'm joining in a collaboration called Hashtag New To Me, and the host is Kimmy's Kitchen and More. And on this video, we share something that is new to us. So how have you all been? I hope you're all doing great. I recently visited a really cool place, and I wanna show you a few clips of it. So I went to Mystic, Connecticut yesterday, and I found an Alice in Wonderland tea shop. 
Now I'm going to give a shout out to Grandma Sandy, that channel, and I'll be adding her link in my description box. She loves Alice in Wonderland, so I'm hoping that she sees this video. So when you went in the shop, it was a tea shop, but it was decorated all with Alice in Wonderland. I just couldn't believe the decor in there. And I took some clips of it, so I want to share that with you. And I also have a few things from Timo. So I'm going to start with the Timo haul, and then I'll show you the clips of the Alice in Wonderland near the end. I only have a few things from Timo today that are new to me. So first of all, I'm going to start off, I have a few pieces of jewelry. I'm also going to show a clip of my outfit of the day and what I'm wearing. I have my Timu ring, angel wings, and the angel necklace. This was all from Timu. And this blouse was from Timu. It wasn't a recent, recent purchase. I purchased this last year. I've been shopping at Timu for quite a while, but I haven't really hauled a lot until lately. So this is what I have here. And when I have jewelry, I like to show you a close-up. But this is gorgeous. This is a pendant of the Bible. This necklace. And it actually opens up. And it has the Our Father prayer in it. Isn't that neat? And there's, I believe, two pages. I'm going to show you a close-up of that so you can see it. So here's a close-up of the pendant, and I'm going to try to flip it so you can see. And then it has another page. There we go. Isn't that neat? Let's flip it over. So, isn't that neat? I just love that piece. Next up, I have another jewelry piece. And this one is, let's see. Oh, I loved this. This is a pendant, and I'm going to hold it up close, and I'll give you a close-up to it. But what this is, I loved how it had a Victorian look, but it is a magnifying glass. So you can actually use it to put it on, let's test out the label on something to see. It's hard to see with the camera. And I thought that was so cool. I can't wait to use this at work. <laughs> So, I'll show you a close-up of that. Oh, here comes my Tootsie. I didn't start with Tootsie because she was snoozing. Do you want to say hello, puppy? Do you want to say hello? So, um, I'll show you a close-up of this one. Pretty neat, hmm? I love that idea. And the last jewelry item I'm going to show you is, if I can get it out, might not even have to do a close-up of this one because the size of this is amazing. Look at the size of this compared to my hand. It's an Eiffel Tower. Isn't it beautiful? And it's actually double-sided, so if it flips around, and it's nice and long, and I'm actually going to put this one on. Oh, it shows up really nice against the yellow. Oh, I love this. This is really nice. And let me get you some of the prices on this jewelry. Okay, so for the Eiffel Tower, which I'm absolutely in love with, $1.26. For the Bible, that was $1.18. And for the magnifying glass, it was $1.25. And they're all really nice. I think the magnifying glass, I think actually all of them can go over the head. Let me just try. This one definitely can. Let's try these. Let me need to take the glasses off my head. Oh no, um, this one's not. Which is unfortunate because I would like to pull this out to use it. I believe it's just going to have to go over my neck. Let's see. I may have to switch out the chain. Yeah, because... I really wanted this where if I had to like quickly take it off, but it is cute. And the, let's see how the 
Bible is. Oh, I think that one goes over the head, which is nice. That figures. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love it. So pretty. It looks really nice on the, um, the solid colors. Let me know in the comments what you think. Oh, I love that. All right. Now, next up, I have a few tops to show you, and I'll make it real quick. I just like to show that if you search in, you can always find some really cute deals. First, I want to show you a cold shoulder, I'm taking it out of the bag, cold shoulder blouse. I love these for the summer, especially when you're going out. Let's see if I'm holding it right. <laughs> Here we go. So it has a V-neck. It has a pretty floral, tiny floral print. And here's the little cuff sleeve here, but it has an open shoulder. Isn't that cute? So I'll try that on for you at the end of the video. You'll see it, but really pretty. It's probably 100% polyester. Pretty much everything they have is. I did get a 2X in these, but I found that some of the things now are starting to run a little big on me, but I may start ordering a little down to an extra large is what I was thinking. Yes, 100% polyester, but it feels nice. It has a nice feel to it. All right, next up, I got this cute red t-shirt that says love, and I love the cheetah print. Very cute. It feels nice. It's not, um, it's not too shiny. It's nice. It looks comfy, and this one's probably, my guess would be polyester also, and I did get the 2X. Yes, 100% polyester, but it's cute, and I'll try that on for you. And I also got the another green t-shirt with the cheetah print. I must have been into cheetah print this day. <laughs> I thought it was cute. They were all marked down really low. That's why I bought them. And this one's also polyester, nice feel. And let me tell you, the green one, this one here, $2.17. So... I just was looking for bargains that day, but I thought they were cute to hang around this summer. And the red one was $2.27. So $2.27. <laughs> Crazy. The, the deals you find when you're searching. This one was a little more. This one was, you ready for it, $4.17. So this was my splurge. <laughs> $4.17. So this was just a mini Timo haul. Let me show you how they look on. I'll show you my outfit of the day. And then we're gonna look at some Alice in Wonderland clips. Okay, so this is the outfit of the day. I love this blouse. It's all about the sleeves with this blouse. They have an elastic at the bottom and it's very soft and flowy and it just feels really feminine and pretty on. Okay, so this one I really love. I love the style. I love the cold shoulder. It has a cute little band on the arm. It fits nice. It's a little loose, but I like to be comfy. And yeah, I give this a Jody thumbs up for sure. Okay, now on to the red top. It has a good sleeve length, nice and long. I give it a thumbs up for that. It's just a comfy, cute, casual t-shirt. Yeah, it's great. And for $2 and change, you can't beat that price. So yeah, this gets a Jody thumbs up. Now on to the green. I love the bright colors, and this is a nice color green. Love the cheetah print, very cute. Good sleeve length, not too short, good length. Fits nice. Yep, definitely. Jody thumbs up. Very cute. For $2 and change, can't beat it. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to the Alice in Wonderland tea. So here is the window when you're walking in, and it's full of teacups and teapots, and there's the rabbit. Unfortunately, we're in a window, so there is a bit of a glare, but I hope you can see all the beautiful teapots. Now we're going inside. There's flowers everywhere and all these little decorations on the ceiling. Beautiful pictures on the wall, lots of mirrors, even the wallpaper. Everything is just so pretty. 
And this is where you order the tea. It's always tea time, and they have all the choices of different teas to try. And there's the Mad Hatter in the corner. And coming up next, you're going to see where Alice in Wonderland fell through the hole, and she's literally hanging out of the ceiling. There she is. Outside of the shops, there's all these little streams and ponds with little ducks in between all the shops. And it's so adorable to look at. And here's a little glimpse of one of those areas. So what'd you think? I just absolutely loved the Alice in Wonderland tea shop. It was so fun to see. It was, it, if you're ever in Connecticut, I definitely recommend hitting it up. It was in, I was in Mystic, Connecticut near the aquarium and there was all about 60 little gift shops and uh, it was just adorable there. So if you're ever in the area, I definitely recommend checking it out. So I'd like to thank Kimmy from Kimmy's Kitchen and More for hosting this. I recommend going to check out our channel and type in hashtag new to me. This is an open collaboration for anybody to join. And I hope you have a wonderful night. Thank you so much for watching, my friends. I'd love for you to also consider subscribing and a thumbs up is greatly appreciated. It helps our channels grow and it lets YouTube know someone's watching our videos. All right. Thank you so much. Have a great night. Bye for now, my friends.